You know, when I was little, I have always wished for a twin sibling, but now I'm glad I don't have one. Oh my God, why? I don't know, I don't want a sibling who is my age and lives with me. For some reason I don't. Sorry for the boring intro, but yeah, anyways, this is Mizo here, and today I'm gonna be reacting to 10 twins you won't believe actually exist. Don't get creeped out. So yeah, let's get to this shit. Today we look at 10 twins you won't believe exist. <laughs> Number Keep 10. It in Carl. Known for coincidentally doing things around the same time, twin sisters no way. Ashley and Amy Nelson unexpectedly delivered baby boys on the same day, just two hours apart from each other. Despite having due dates about a week apart, Amy's son Donovan Bratton was born at 12.11 p.m. and Ashley's son Aiden Ditz was born at 2.03 p.m. that same day, both at Summa Akron City Hospital Damn. in Ohio. According to the sisters, the nearly simultaneous pregnancies were not planned and a complete surprise. Amy found out she was pregnant two days after Ashley did, saying, I started having the same symptoms as her. The twins' mother, Marcella Farson, said that the two have often ended up doing the, the same things twins. without planning it. Number nine. At a twins convention in Twinsburg, they look Ohio, identical, though, identical but twin brothers Craig and Mark Sanders met and instantly fell in love with identical twin sisters Darlene and Diane Nettemeyer. After dating for a year, the twin brothers proposed on the same day. Did they have kids? In 1999, kids? the couples married in a double wedding. If that's not enough that's, to have that's the same pretty couple, interesting. in 2001, Craig and Diane gave birth to identical twin boys Colby and Brady, making this twin-tastic family even more of a rarity. The odds of having identical twins are three in every 1,000 births, and identical twins have no hereditary traits that would cause a predisposition to having identical twins. The chance of identical twins marrying identical twins and then giving birth to identical twins are millions to one. Number eight. Known as the Jim Twins, brothers Jim Lewis and Jim Springer were separated at birth. As oh, I heard about this. As two different families and coincidentally both given the first name Jim and living nearly the exact same lives. To start off the almost freaky similarities, both brothers were adopted by families living in Ohio. Actually, they grew up a mere 45 miles apart and didn't even know it. Springer having been told his twin brother had died and Lewis knowing only that his brother existed. Both brothers had a childhood dog named Toy. Both were married twice. Their first wives named Linda and their second wives both named Betty. What? Had children, including sons named James Allen, and both lived on the only houses on their block. Both brothers were chain smokers, enjoyed beer, had woodworking shops in their garages, drove Chevrolets, and worked as sheriffs in separate Ohio counties. The two only found out about their identical lives on February 9th, 1979, when they finally met after Lewis was successful in his two-year search for his brother. Number seven. That's Keen oh, Narita insane. and Jean Connie, known affectionately as Keen San Jean San, were Japan's oldest twins who became media celebrities in their last decade. Keen means gold and Jean means silver in Japanese. Both born to a farming family in Nagoya, central Japan on August 1st, 1892, the twins were designated national treasures in 1991 by the government. Year before Supposedly Pepsi. the four foot two sisters celebrated their Hunter's birthday by releasing a song which became a chart hit, although I could find no record of it. Known as a happy, lovable pair who joked about life just getting started at 100, the sisters landed numerous product endorsements and contracts writing advice columns in magazines, earning them enough money to file their very first tax returns at the young age of 101 and allowing them to start traveling at age 102. When asked about the secret to living a long life, Kinsan said, Eat well, sleep well, and play well. Keen died of a heart failure in January 2000 at age Aww. 107, while her sister Jean died in February of 2001 at age 108. She lived in three centuries. Number mm. six. Born in 1946 and known under the alias the McGuire Twins, brothers Billy Leon and Benny Lloyd McCrary not only traveled the world as professional wrestlers, but also held the Guinness World Record for heaviest twins. Known throughout the United States and abroad, having traveled around the world seven times, the twins were undefeated tag team champions for 14 years. To That's add to cool. their wrestling fame, in November of 1978, Billy weighed 743 pounds and Benny weighed 723 pounds, earning them the Guinness World Record for heaviest twins. 
Billy died of a heart failure following a motorcycle accident in 1979. Damn. After his twin's death, Benny left the spotlight to become an auctioneer and pawnbroker with his own business until he died on March 26, 2001. Number five. Michael Jackson once said, it doesn't matter if you're black or white. And two oh, yeah. twin sisters from Great Britain could not agree more. Lucy Aylmer, 19, is white, while so. Maria is black. Their mother, Donna, is half Jamaican, and their father, Vince, is Caucasian. Both parents were stunned upon their children's arrival. Naturally, yeah, nothing I've, in modern I've heard about technology could tell them beforehand that each child would have a different color of skin. Since Lucy and Maria are not identical twins, they came from separate eggs and therefore do not have identical DNA. Yeah. And thus, by chance, Maria has the genes that code for black skin, while Lucy has genes for white skin. White, yeah. However, the twin sisters' other siblings are all varying degrees of light skin black, and the two twins represent the extreme of opposites. Number four. Hmm. Oh, yeah. Abigail and Brittany Hensel of New Germany, Minnesota are not just twin sisters. They are conjoined, so much so that they appear to have a single body without any distinguishable physical separation. More rare is that each twin, though conjoined, has a separate heart, stomach, spine, lungs, and spinal cord. Damn. Activities such as swimming or walking must be performed yeah, with I've the cooperation of both. Tasks which seem Not simple person, for the though. rest of us, like combing one's hair, require the Hensel sisters to perform two separate functions in order to complete the task. For example, one might comb the hair while the other parts the hair in sections. The story of the 26-year-olds has made it to Life Magazine, The Oprah Winfrey Show, TLC, and Keeping It Carl. Number three. Filed this under the perfect crime. In January of 2009, close to $7 million worth of jewelry was pilfered from posh department store Kaufhaus des Westens in Berlin, Germany. Three masked burglars were captured not by cops, but by surveillance cameras cascading down the store's bright light fixtures, somehow slipping under the state of the art security system. Fortunately, the authorities did retrieve DNA evidence, sweat on a latex glove. The droplets matched a known criminal, and then another. Both criminals are twin brothers, Hassan and Abbas O. German law hmm. forbids their surname to be revealed. Both brothers, unsurprisingly, share 99.99% of their gene data. Because Damn. of this, no judge or jury could ever convict one or the other of pulling off the heist. The burglars didn't tie anyone's hands during the yeah, burglary, they the but they might as well have tied the, the prosecutor's hands. Neither brother could be sent to prison. Number two. Some people plunk down $240,000 on a Lucy. Lamborghini or a down payment for a house. 30-year-old sisters Anna and Lucy De Cinque from Perth, Australia blew that same amount of money on plastic surgery. To look younger? No. To look more alike. And get this, they're already identical twins. From lip fillers to breasts, the De Cinque's have gone to the last measure to ensure that they are each other's mirror image. They share their food, job, Facebook account, and bed. But the weirdness doesn't end there. They're both sharing the same boyfriend, electrical engineer Ben Byrne, who apparently must have saved an orphan village in a past life. Burns' friends claim he's in the perfect situation, except all three share close quarters with the twin's mother. Ironically, Byrne is also a twin. No word yet on whether his twin wants a piece of the action. And now for our number one set of twins you won't believe exist. Uh -oh. But first, I want to give a shout out to those who answered my last video's question. If you could clone anyone, who would you clone and why? Number one. Um... Witness a love triangle that's as diabolical as it gets. In 2013, oh, sounds... Edith Casas and Victor Singolani, both of Argentina, exchanged wedding vows. On the surface, they seem like a normal, happy couple. Except Singolani has been serving a 12-year sentence for the murder of Johanna Casas, a fashion model found dead three years earlier, Edith's twin sister. Singolani had been dating Johanna, later claiming he broke up with her, and that Johanna's subsequent boyfriend, Marco Diaz, is the real killer. His marriage to Edith was considered so bizarre that Edith had to complete a court-ordered psychiatric evaluation in order to marry him. Damn. That was some interesting shit right there. I think the most I interesting twins are um, Jim Lewis and Jim Springer. Like, they just, they have almost everything in common. It's like one of them came from another universe. To have everything in common like that, like, 
That's like a one out of a trillion, not even like quintillion, immeasurable. And the second most interesting one was the black and white twins. I'm pretty sure none of the people would believe that they're twins. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video and I'll be back with another reaction. Well, Q&A. Peace!